I am happy to report to the nation that the government of Kenya and the government of Italy have agreed and in fact the process of sorting out the matters in court has already started in earnest. We as the government of Kenya are going to withdraw the cases filed against the companies and the uh, government of Italy is, and the contractors are also going to withdraw the arbitration cases. We have agreed that the restart of this project projects is not only urgent, it is priority, it is necessary because it's going to supply water to many towns in Nakuru County and Kericho County and many uh, other areas in Baringo and Elgeyo Maraguet County. We have agreed that the financing that was already made available is going to be restructured and the projects are going to start. We intend to clear the court issues in the next one month and be able to start the process of negotiating uh, the restructuring of financing and hopefully we should be able to go on with the construction of these dams in a matter of months. That is the agreement that the two governments have agreed on. Thank you very much. Non tocca a me rispondere, ma vorrei dire che, che apprezzo e condivido la risposta del Presidente Ruto. Ferrara Sky TG24 Sky News. Presidente Mattarella, una domanda che rivolgo poi anche al Presidente Ruto. Sappiamo che il tema dei migranti non è un tema principale al centro di questi colloqui, ma resta pur sempre un tema di stretta e purtroppo sempre più spesso tragica attualità per il nostro Paese, per l'Italia, per il Mediterraneo, Italia frontiera marittima dell'Europa anche alla luce delle ultime notizie, delle ultime ipotesi di e centinaia... Ore, deve parlare più Just hold on, I think uh, the president is not hearing what sì. you say. Dicevo, presidente, ehm, che il tema dei migranti sappiamo non essere un tema eh, tra i temi principali al centro di questi colloqui, eh, ma resta pur sempre un tema di stretta attualità e sempre più spesso tragica eh, attualità per il nostro Paese, eh, paese eh, di frontiera mediterranea, di frontiera dell'Europa, anche alla luce delle ultime notizie, delle ultime ipotesi di centinaia di migliaia di possibili partenze dal Nord Africa alla volta eh, dell'Italia. Eh, lei ha sempre indicato come via quella di aprire dei canali formali e di collaborazione con i paesi di origine dei flussi. Ebbene, il rapporto privilegiato eh, tra Italia e Kenya, tra Roma e Nairobi, eh, può essere un modello di riferimento come cooperazione allo sviluppo in settori importanti, come abbiamo sentito, eh, tecnologia, ricerca, ambiente, eh, scientifici, anche da questo punto di vista, può essere un modello di riferimento di questo senso. because the cooperation between Italy and Kenya uh, has reached excellent levels and they truly can be a benchmark uh, for everyone, which can be replicated everywhere. We have excellent relations with all countries, of course, and we would like to uh, continue having excellent relations with everyone. Also because we can only deal with common problems if we cooperate well. Uh, this, of course, uh, applies to all of the issues you mentioned, beginning with migration. We uh, want to have uh, good cooperation with the countries of origin and the countries of transit when it comes to migration, but we know that uh, the dimension of migration, its entity, which is growing everywhere in the world, cannot be dealt with only bilaterally. Migration can only be dealt with together in a well-organized European action that can uh, deal with this uh, major issue uh, in an effective way. This, of course, affects uh, the Mediterranean route, but it also uh, affects the Balkan route. These are two elements which intersect. And through good bilateral cooperation, of course, we can become uh, more aware and we can have more 
organic approach within the framework of the European Union on all topics, including migration. Good afternoon, Your Excellencies. My name is Leila Mohamed from MTV Kenya. Both you, Excellencies, Italy has invested a lot in, in Kenya in terms of the tourism sector. Uh, in your deliberations this morning, have you discussed on ways in which Kenyans can also invest in the Italian economy. And uh, President Ruto, you spoke about uh, the President Mattarella uh, giving Kenya a part on the back in terms of uh, diplomacy in ensuring peace in the region. How then do you take this conversation in terms of enabling Kenya to undertake its peace mandate within the region in terms of uh, any form of uh, assistance, whether financial or uh, otherwise? Thank you. Thank you very much. I think in the context of our conversation this morning and afternoon, the issue of Kenya playing a pivotal role in, as a stabilizing factor in our region was an issue that was discussed. We have agreed that Italy, through the EU, will be supporting our efforts, both in Somalia where the EU is a very big player in supporting our troops in Somalia. We have also agreed that we will be having a conversation later this month when I visit uh, Brussels on what the EU can do uh, to support our troops and the interventions we are making in DRC Congo, where, again, um, the conversation is going to be about the participation of Italy and the EU in supporting our efforts in stabilizing our region. And it goes a long way in responding to the issue that was earlier asked to President Mattarella about migration. The best way to encourage reasonable migration and ensuring that there is equitable development everywhere in the globe is to make sure that there are opportunities everywhere in the globe. What we, the conversation we are having with the EU is on how they can support us in the continent to unlock the huge possibilities to our young people in green energy, in green agriculture, in green industrialization that will then ensure that opportunities are available in every, part, in every part of the globe, not just in sections of the globe. And as you are aware, the EU, including Italy, is the single largest market of Kenyan exports. That conversation I am going to further it when I go to Brussels on how using um, the economic partnership agreements that are in, con in discussion, we can facilitate, we can expand more market for our products from tea, coffee, horticulture, avocados, and all the other crops that we are engaged in. So it is a balanced conversation where Italy is investing in Kenya, and Kenya is also benefiting from the market that is expanded in the EU, including in Italy. Thank you. Aggiungo una breve risposta che il Presidente Ruto ha già dato in maniera. Let me add a brief answer to the things uh, uh, President Ruto said. Uh, 